heading out to see those white things over there. He's just arrived with his mighty gyro, which has been assembled and test running it on the ground at the moment. Where are we? Right. Oil temperature very slowly starting to rise. We're on a full power climb at the moment, 31.9 or 31.50. What are we, 1300 feet? At um, not a bad climb rate of uh, 55. New transponder, woohoo. New lights, nice. And GPS telling me uh, that it's quite windy if I stick my elbow at the side. <laughs> Where are we? 57 knots. And I've got 50 on the screen, so. Oh, I was a. It's near enough. Got any oil pressure. Temperature's coming up. We're going that way. See how high I can get. Haha. <laughs> I'll try one of these again. Uh, I don't have a um, the thing that used to hang here. Uh, the balance ball. Oh, I've taken that out. I need to get a little tiny one made up to go in front of, or just above the airspeed indicator. Uh, just a just a startling day out here, really. And all the mank and rubbish that the rest of the country is putting up with, and we've got this. Look at it, blue sky everywhere. <laughs> nice. Oh, well, we're a bit closer to the hills. Oh, Jackson, traffic, okay, in one, that gets really in 5,000 uh, We've managed to get to, ooh, what's that, 6,600? Oil temp's only 72 degrees, still got 55 pound of pressure, 3100 RPM, and 55 pounds around That's just lovely. That's the view of the hills. Lovely, lovely, lovely. What a day, what a marvellous day. What a marvellous week. <laughs> Woohoo! Right, well, uh, that there is the Whitcomb Pass. I'm sure if this is working very well. It's very cold. There's every chance it will have frozen. Uh, almost 9,000 feet. That's a new height record for me. It's, it's unbelievably cold. Uh, yeah, I can't feel bits. <laughs> and the traffic that be fine. Oh, well, that's, um, that's enough height and cold, I think. <laughs> 8,500 feet. All in amongst the white fluffy stuff. So, um, Okie Pokey's just over there, we'll uh, just go back there and drop down a wee bit. And, uh, yeah, try and get a bit warmer. Just an amazing day. Pretty much halfway there actually, but uh, off to Okarito. Currently zipping along at 650 feet. I was at 500, I got 150 feet out of that hill that's back there. I don't know if it's coming out or not, but it's back there. Just lovely down. There's a wee bit of a sea breeze there. Uh, everything's just hanging along nicely. We've got a very nice 65 degrees of oil, 55 pound of pressure. Uh, indicated speed of 55 and an actual speed of 55. Woohoo! Things are working. Uh, there's another aircraft about to approach. He's just gone past Mark, so I guess he's um, coming uh, my way. So, uh, yeah, Mark Pallet is probably already at Ocarino. He's went to Zoop Pass quite a while ago. Mark, Ralph is behind me. And I'm in somewhere in the middle. Just gone over the White Tower River. Uh, that's not it, that's just a creek in some form. Yeah. Lovely day for it. Lovely day for it. It's a cracker day. You must be um, just about dragging everything out to slow down to my feet. Yup. <laughs>
I'm not sure if it all came out as a silhouette or not. But um, there he is. Yeah, that does get along quite fast, doesn't it? This is a lovely machine. There he is, off at a million miles an hour. Not that I've got anything against Jodel. You look very nice indeed. Why, thank you. I may not have speed, but I do have class. Oh, it, man. Uh, where are we? We are nine miles north of Ocarito. That's the Ocarito estuary there. Still only getting to 65 on the oil, which is very good. Still about 50 pound oil. Very good. And uh, I've managed to get the Bluetooth working with the cell phone, so I have music. You can't hear it, but I can. It's wonderful. Girl, girl's just humming along lovely. Yeah. Oh, well, we'll uh, fire up when we're a bit closer. From a distance, it looks just like a lovely, normal 701 should do. Unfortunately, closer inspection of the training wheel at the front shows that it's oh not quite as straight as when it left the factory and if we have a quiet look under here um, it's got the new modified high lift wing you see there it's all under camber modified of course exclusively by the Ocarito Gorse which also did a, a trimming job it's now a high speed propeller so there's less on that side than there is on here and these bits here are mm, not very flash. The speedo will now pick up sideways movement rather than anything else. And a bit of a hole there. The rest of it's not bad. The other wing's fine. I don't think that one's extra thing. That one, no, that's apart from your front bits. This one's alright. There's a wee bit more of a ripple kind of there. It's a bit hard to pick up with uh, what have you. Ah. I don't think I'll bother tying it down tonight. <laughs> I'll drag it. 